All right. Um, I gotta zoom out so that way we can see all the cards. Let's do that. I also have this Agricola extension installed. I hope that that works. Uh, <laughs> if it doesn't work, then whatever. It'll it'll be fine, I guess. Um, okay, and the boards are down here. Whatever. We'll deal with that in a second. Um, uh, we're picking a Field Watchman because Field Watchman's broke as heck. Uh, and then we're also going to pick, um, one of these other really busted cards. Uh, what am I picking here? Hmm. What a load of possibilities we have. Uh, I'm going second in the player order. That's a good thing to note. We're going second in the player order here. What am I doing? I might have to move my camera around too a little bit. So um, also chat, if you're new, if you're confused on what a Grickle is, uh, I've, I've added some nice point redemptions for that. What else am I doing here? Straw Thatch Troop is very good with Field Watchmen and I can get it up very, very early. Um, I'm very tempted to do that, actually. I'm very tempted to just straw thatched roof the field watchman. It, it's just like so good. It's it's like almost certainly gonna wheel. What else is in this pack? There's there's like four cards in this pack, right? There's Lone Pit, Big Country, Rammed Clay. There's like Hatch. I wouldn't I wouldn't be super upset with that. I don't know. Like all these cards are good. Like it's the field watchman is just like so busted. Plowing plowing fields on green, so good. God, if I zoom in one more, it doesn't work. No, dude, sixty seven percent is too much. All right, that's fine. Whatever. We want, we want nice big juicy cards here. Um, yeah, this is fine. We'll, we'll just do this. We'll just do this. We'll we'll do the the green thing. We'll we'll just we'll just break a game really quick and then and then peace out from there. We'll just do that. Maybe we can wheel this livestock feeder, livestock feeder, like, like things that are green payoffs are like so stupid with Field Watchmen. It's so stupid. No, I'm getting a phone call. No, dude, phone call, go away. Go away, phone. Also, I, I, I have thematically chosen some nice farming music. Oh, it's so nice, Cassie. Yo, Cassie, if you've not seen the BGA interface, you're in for a, uh, a schlock. You're in for a shock. Uh, cattle feeder is cute, but I don't like it, honestly. Um, puppeteer is good, but I don't like it, honestly. Constable is good, and I like it, honestly. So we're going to do that. Um, bookcase is crazy. I don't think I need bookcase, though. I might loom it up. Loom is just so busted. It's so insane. Yeah, it's so clean. Yeah, I mean, it only does it only does three points instead of five. It's only three points, so it's not, like, super broken, but it's, like, fine. Uh, plows out. Mantelpiece is crazy. Looms very good. Granaries out. I like hunting trophy. Uh, the case is also so good. Oh, hello. Thank you for the follow, Derange. What's up? How's it going? Uh, I appreciate that. I don't know if I'm going to stream Agricola again, but I, I have been playing this game so freaking much. I've been playing this game a stupid amount. Uh, is Loom any good? Yeah, Loom's crazy. Loom's always good. Loom is never not good. Mantelpiece is also really good. I don't think I'm going to end up... Ugh, I could reno really fast with Mantelpiece and then just do that. Pretty close, honestly. Um, if Purple makes his decision, I'm just going to make a decision. Yo, I usually stream uh, Pokemon speedruns. <laughs> Another speedruns. I normally do speedruns. Um, oh, no, they made a decision. Okay, we're just picking Mantelpiece. We're just going to Mantelpiece. Uh, actually, I changed my mind. Loom's just broken. No, I changed my mind again. We're just Mantelpiecing. We're Mantelpiecing. We're just going to Reno early on. It's going to be fine. Uh, we're just going to Reno early on. It's going to be great. Yeah, I, I normally do uh, I normally do lots of speed runs. Speed running is fun. Uh, but I I don't normally stream Agricola. I've been, I've been like trying to play a lot of other games because I enjoy other games. But right now, I've been playing so much Agricola that like it, it's seeping into my free time where like I, I'm a professor, so like I teach for a living. So like when things get very busy, um, I like to... No, dude, punished. Uh, I, when things get very busy, I like to, uh, I, I like to use my stream as a way to play games that I, I can't really play in my free time. Um, so right now I'm just like, I'm trying to, to merge the games that I want to play in my free time with the, uh, games that I want to play on stream for a little bit, for a little bit. At some point I want to go back to speedrunning. I want to do some more speedrunning stuff, but, um, also Wood Expert's just very good. Especially with this type of draft where I probably have a lot of food. And given that, I'm probably going to take wood cart. I'm not as high on wood, wood expert as other people, but I think it's probably good enough here. Tutor's probably insane too, but I, I just want to play Field Watchman on turn one. I don't really want to do anything else. 
Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, normally it's, uh, I've been doing lots of Pokemon speedruns where, like, so the speedrun itself averages, like, around two hours, but, like, typically what'll happen is that you have to, like, do a bunch of attempts to get a run going, because there's so much RNG in, like, getting a run going. So, like, typically what you do is that you end up, like, uh, you know, doing lots of attempts, and the attempts will fail, and then you keep doing attempts, and so, like, you play for, like, I I'll do, se a lot of people, when they speedrun, they do sessions of, like, two, three hours. It's kind of like Agricola, actually. Like, some people play one game of Agricola, and then that's it. Um, I, on the other hand, like, no, so punished. No, dude, we got so punished. We're taking this anyways because this card's nuts. Um, but we got very, very punished for uh, not not picking the loom. Whatever rolls, Reno, and play an early mantle piece. I could Freemason. Freemason is fine. You don't need Seed Seller with uh, Field Watchman. Uh, Baker is honestly not terrible. You really want a Cooking Hearth with Field Watchman. And with Cooking Hearth, you're not super duper likely to like actually want to bake. Like sometimes you'll end up so baking, but most of the time you want to bake at the harvest. Like you want to you want to do it after you harvest the grain. So Baker is not that bad for that. Definitely don't want Pattern Maker. It's it's between Freemason and Baker, but I don't think this is a Freemason game. We could Freemason. It's not very good though. It's like six clay. Screw. We'll we'll just take Baker. We'll, let's play a really basic strategy. Yo, what's up? We're, yeah, it's farming simulator. Yeah, it, it's uh, <laughs> we're just farming simulatoring. It's just a, we're simulating farming. Okay. Um, ooh, they added high farmer in. That's exciting. We wield the loam pit. That's exciting. We wield big country. That's. I mean, if you're gonna pass me big country, then I'm gonna take it. I'm never gonna not take big country. You pass me clay up builder too. What are you doing, dude? What are we doing here? You really gonna pass me a clay hut builder in a big country? You're really gonna do that with a mantelpiece? Mantelpiece kind of point caps me a little bit, but I think this is good enough by itself. I think we can just go like Reno. I pass it for a straw that's roof because I'm I'm very uh I'm very focused on card combos. I, I like to focus on card combos a lot. Um I I also I, I don't like picking big country with field watchman. I don't think it's a great combo. I, I think that it's like fine. I think I think Strawthatch Truth is way more powerful. Strawthatch Truth is like way, way, way more powerful. I think this combo is nice. This is a good combo. I'm pretty in on this. Yeah, I don't want any of these, right? Oh, I want the livestock feeder so bad though. But Clay Hut Builder is just too good. We're planning on renoing early on anyways, right? Because we're gonna get Field Watchman Strawthatch Truth set up. Um, are we planning on renoing early on? Oh, and I gotta think about this. Hold on one second. I'm, I'm gonna write think really quick. Think, 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 think. Uh, let me write a think. Uh, do I want animals? Do I want 10 clay? Yeah, I just want 10 clay. Why would I not want 10 clay? 10 clay is so good. I'll, I'll hold animals some other way. Uh, Puppeteer's crazy. Uh, YOLO layabout. I'm not playing any of these other cards, I don't think. Yeah, we're just never playing any of these other cards. Par Ceramics is kind of cute, I guess. It's a free card to play on a minor. I don't know if I'm going to need this much, like any grain at all. Uh, I mean, I'm not playing any of these other cards. I'll just pick Layabout just in case something really bad happens. There's no way I'm ever playing Layabout though. Why would I ever play Layabout? I'm never playing Layabout here. No chance. Yeah, Clay Builder Strat That Truth seems fine. Like, it seems fine. I don't know. Big, big Country, like, I've been lower on Big Country recently just because, like, I mean, it's still a very good card, but, like, I hate warping my game around it. I want to try new things. I don't want to play big country games like every game, and it's very tempting to do that. All right, this pack sucks. Uh, we're just picking this because we are baking bread. Hello, can I pick an action, please? Uh, what am I hating here? What would I rather hate from this pack? I guess we'll let other people fight over fields. Other people can fight over fields. That's more advantageous for us because we're not we're not really adding much. Like we're adding so many fields to the game. We might as well take some. Tutor this late, that's disrespectful. Um Market Stall actually pretty good. Uh Bread Paddle's fine, but we have Baker and we don't have an insane amount of ox that we want to play. So like I I'll just play Market Market Stall's actually fine with Field Watchman. You get so, so stupid amounts of grain. Uh so we'll do this. It doesn't really matter why I pick. Um, so I guess we'll pick a tutor. Yeah, we're not playing Cattle Whisperer because we don't we don't have the Cattle Whisperer combo. So we'll just pick tutor and be fine with it. 
we'll just pick tutor and be fine with it. Yeah, I mean, we have a plan. Our plan is to reno to, to clay really early on with the mantelpiece. Um, we're going to field watchman three times in phase one and then sew it so that we can straw thatch roof. Um, and then we are going to be fed for the rest of the game because field watchman's broken and then that's going to be the game. <laughs> so that's going to be it. Uh, yeah, I mean, that's fair. No, like, Big Country is like that. Big Country is like a card where, like, if you know the Big Country plan, like, there's a couple of cards in this game. It's like, okay, if you know the plan with this card and you just execute this plan every single time, it's super duper broken. Uh, it's like, I won't say it's broken. It's just, like, very good. It's a very clear way to build a game plan. And you can, like, typically get, like, you know, at least a mid 40 high, like, a low 50, something like that, like, with that. I, I don't like playing that because I, I think I'm, I'm at the point where, A, we're playing with CD cards. So like I just want to play with new stuff um, and B uh, I, it's just very annoying okay well we're field watchmen and graining here can I can I get four grain fields is that actually good I don't think it is but we're gonna go for it anyways all right easy peasy oh I gotta zoom out wait let me zoom out really quick is this the right zoom I, I think this seems okay to me but I can't tell if there's a better zoom setting by the way that someone can let me know for for how it looks then let me know I'm, I'm happy to to change things around to make it look a little bit better I'm very very happy to do that uh, oh I can change the size of player boards that's interesting and the size of cards a little bit that's interesting too oh and I can change this wait what Wait, this this doesn't this isn't good. It's it's fading into the other board. It's eating my other board. I don't like that at all. Uh okay, okay, okay. So these I can barely read now. <laughs> wait, can I zoom in one more? No, that's not good. Uh wait, 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 can I if I if I do this, okay, that's not good. That's not good. Okay, we have a blueprint here. That's good for us because that means we get to go second next round, which hopefully means that we get a good wood action. Um we're just doing this always. We're never not doing that. Actually, the, the action that I really want is a four clay action. If we get a four clay action, I'm taking that for sure. Four clay action, I'm like almost certainly taking here. But yeah, if the cards are too small or anything, chat, let me know um, because I want to make sure that things are sort of visible. Uh, I don't know what the settings are that, that like anyone else uses. So, oh, we can change the speed of the animation when a card is played. That's funny. Um, okay, no, I don't need the read at all. And Reedstone food got taken. That's very annoying. Uh, Want to play Wood Expert here? Wood Expert. So I need a clay action. What are we doing? Okay, hold on one second. I got to count actions. Um, So we're playing Wood Expert. We could just go for wood. Yeah, maybe I'm just taking a three wood action here. I, building one wood room might not be too bad. Yeah, the way it looks, I don't have many productive actions other than building a wood room here. So I think that that's probably what we're gonna do. Taking three wood is never like too super bad anyways. We're just on kind of an aggressive plan here. Our plan is a little bit aggressive. We definitely want a four clay drop. If a four clay drop happens, we're like smashing it. Um, if a, yeah, read, we just could not care about this game. All right, so we got a bonehead. Bonehead, really good. Excavator, also really good. Excavator makes that when you day labor, you get a bunch of resources. That card's great. Blueprint means we're never getting a pottery joinery basket makers, but it means that the person in front of us is going to be taking a uh, starting player over and over again, which is great, which I love it. Um, oh, and stone cutter. That's a good combo. We'd love to see that. Um, in our position, we'd love to see that because we're like not really, we don't really care that much about majors. Um, hopefully this person lays off the freaking reed stone food. That would be nice. Um, I don't really have any good actions here. I'm just going to green seeds again. We really want a reed stone food. Reed stone food is the action that we're really craving here. We really want one reed stone food because we want to reno and, and play this freaking uh, mantelpiece as soon as possible. I want I want a ton of clay. I want an insane amount of clay. You you don't want to buy a uh, clay oven with this strategy. You really want to buy a uh, cooking hearth. Cooking hearth is just insane. Really want cooking hearth. Um, even though cooking hearth is kind of lame because uh, you don't get the bake immediately. We have like baker if we really need it. I mean, if we really need to, we'll buy a clay oven, but we can honestly raw eat grain too. I'm fine with raw eating grain here. Not a big deal. I do kind of want to play this wood expert. Kind of want to play it. 
Well, hopefully we get a good action here. Hopefully we get a four clay action. We might, I might go for four grain fields here before anything else happens, but I may not. There's also a spot where if I keep getting wood actions, it's worth thinking about pivoting into a, a big country. Okay, well, they're gonna kill that by taking that, that thing. Uh, please pass me the four clay. Can we get the four clay here, please? Please give me the four clay. That's all I want. All I want is this four clay. I, I don't want anything else except for this four clay here. We want four clay, grain seeds, reed stone food. So those are the only actions I want. Oh, we don't even need reed stone food. Oh, I forgot we don't need reed for Reno if we just throw off that true fit, but I need a stone somehow. Um, getting a stone is an issue. Hmm. Probably we have to take reed stone food anyway then. Probably we have to take reed stone food anyways. Uh, how do I get a good feeding engine going? I need the four clay. I need the four clay like so bad. Yeah, we gotta go four clay, grain, so reedstone food, something like that, and then that way I don't have to eat a grain. It's something along those lines. I love this Stardew Valley music. Probably this game I'll play Stardew Valley music. Next time I'll play something a little bit more uh, hyphy. <laughs> I'll play something a little bit, a little bit more uh, spunky. I don't know if my camera's in a good position here either. Maybe, maybe I can move my camera over a little bit so that people can see the the resources a little bit more. But yeah, let me let me know if there's anything about the stream setup that that I can change to make things a little bit more visible because this is my. Uh, Thing. I mean, we don't really need it. That's the problem is that we don't need a feeding action. Like if we get a four food, I'll take it. Like we might get a four food here. The, pro the problem is that we really don't need it like at all. We really don't need a feeding action. Not not even a little bit. I mean, I'll take a three food action if it gets to me, but like a, a three or a four food action. The problem is that I don't need it. Like you can just raw eat grain. There's nothing wrong with raw eating grain. Um, okay, this starting player is very good for us. Can we wheel a six wood here? Starting player BMW is hot. Uh, that means we are not getting a reed stone food back. Uh, yeah, we'll just eat raw grain. Our plan is all straw, straw thatch roof. That's our entirety of our plan. That's that's our plan here. Uh, can I wheel a four clay here? Actually, I have an idea. Wait, I have an idea, chat. We have an idea. I'm gonna take uh, four clay. Yeah, we're gonna take four clay here. This is fine, I think. Okay, four clay is fine. Four clay is okay. I, I don't. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna hope this four clay wheels. I think that's greedy. We're not gonna hope for that. All right, the food's going relatively fast. This game. Uh, we're gonna ride one grain. We're just gonna ride a grain. We're, we're just gonna not care at all. Because rioting a grain is fine. Like, one grain is totally fine to rot eat. Hello, music. What happened to my Stardew Valley complete soundtrack? Okay, it's back. <laughs> um, oh, let me, hold on, let me move my chat a little bit. My chat's in kind of a bad spot. Let me see if I can move this. Let's see if I can move my chat really quick. Let's just move this, like, right up here. Is this a good spot for it? This looks like a good spot for it. Uh, I could not grain this turn, but we're gonna grain this turn, because why not? Yeah, we'll just grain. I'll grain. Make it grain. Gotta make it grain. It's very important. Oh, do I take the four clay stack? I could just grain again, honestly. I'm thinking about just graining again. I can get grain next turn. Or to get clay next turn, sorry. I can get clay next turn. So, okay, so what I'm thinking is that I go grain sow. That takes care of my food for an eternity. I take clay, start player, for throughout that roof. I go reno, cooking implement. My food's a little scuffed here. Reno, food implement. I can't really play this mantelpiece, unfortunately. I can't afford to take this grain. I can't afford to do that. I have to go clay pit so here. Yeah, we gotta go clay pit so. Okay, we're gonna go clay pit so. Yeah, we'll just do this. We'll we'll just go clay pit so. We need an insane amount of clay this game. Clay is clay is just insane for us. We don't really want to fight in on the wood. The clay's better. I just don't. I don't really. I can't be bothered with that. Uh, it, no, no, it's for Reno. Reno. Uh, what's it called? It is for Reno cooking hearth. 
because Cooking Arth is crazy with Field Watchmen. Cooking Arth is so much better than uh, than a freaking yeah. Hearth, Hearth's way better. Yeah, wait, wait, Hearth is so much better. Hearth is an insane amount of food with Field Watchmen. You get so much food off Hearth with Field Watchmen. It's like so nuts. Clay Oven's just bad with Field Watchmen because like you you like it 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 doesn't give you as much food like and it's harder to get the stone especially in this instance like where I might not even get the amount of stone that I need for uh, for everything here like I think this is gonna be really really good yeah we'll just ride a grain here raw eat a grain I might sow for six food at some point I might do that I think that might actually be good is once I've renoed I can sow for six food. Once I've renoed, I can just sew for six food here. All right, my, my chat's in a way better spot now. I'm, I'm more aesthetically happy. Oh, I, I guess I can move myself over too. Maybe maybe that's a better move too. I can, I can just like, uh, wait, hello, where is my, where's my video? Video capture device. Let's move myself over like just a little bit. So I'm like in this nice little gap here. And then we're gonna take my, oh no, 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 that's not what I want, this thing. And then we're gonna move it over here too. Yeah, there we go. Look how nice I am now. I'm just like right in the middle of everything. So pretty. Plows, yep. Yeah, I just, um, this guy's got a nice, Intel's got a nice old setup of just freaking smashing uh, basket maker stuff. It's very cool. I like it. I, I'm a sucker for uh, guild strategies. I'm a big sucker for them. All right, so we're hoping that Reno flips soon. If it doesn't, I can always build in wood. If it doesn't, I'll just build in wood. Like, I'm not averse to it. We're definitely going to strong player straw thatch roof at some point. That's definitely going to happen. But I'll build in room if, or in wood if I really need to. Is anyone else close to building? This guy's kind of close to building. He's going to take the wood for sure. Um, I would not like to take a beggar here. We'll just ride a grain because riding grain is totally fine. Yeah, there's just no need to do anything else when you're playing with field watchmen. There's just no no need. You just like freaking uh, do this thing. It's totally fine. Oh, Reno flip. Let's go. Uh, so I want this clay. <laughs> I want this clay very badly. Um, I want this clay. I need more clay. I'm short on clay here. God, I can't get this stone for this freaking mantelpiece. I'm so sad. Getting this stone cost me so many actions to get it. Okay, we're not building here. Building's not happening. Uh, I want a clay action. If I don't get a clay action, what am I doing? Yeah, okay, we're a starting player and hope it gets to six clay. That's gonna be our line. So we're, we're starting with this. We have to get this out. It, it's a, it's obligatory. There, there's no other options. We have to get this out. We have to run out of clay. That's what we have to do. Um, we're, gonna, we're gonna just try and sneak into the growth queue after this. No, he knows, dude. He knows. He knows everything. Okay, this is fine, though. This is fine. So what we're gonna do instead is that next turn, we're gonna go, like, grain, so, ock, uh... Yeah, we can go grain, so awk. God, I want to pivot to like a big country type of strategy, but that's bad. I, I want to play this clay hut builder. This clay hut builder is going to be huge. I don't want to raw eat a grain for it though. Raw eating grain for it is terrible. I could just so bake to get six food here, honestly. I'm thinking about doing that. So we can go, what else, what else am I doing? Stone cart. I really want to play this wood expert, but I don't know if I'm gonna have time for it. Not, not being able to get a stone here just sucks. Not being able to get a stone here is just awful. It's very bad for us that, that we can't get a stone here. But, like, it, it's it's really a first-world problem because, like, we have Straw Thatch Roof in play in round five, which, like, is obviously crazy. Um, all right, sneaking into the growth queue looks like it's going to be hard. So I have to play around not being able to sneak into the growth queue. So because we can't get sneak into the growth queue, we are just going to play a game as if we, we just don't care about growth uh, for now. We are definitely going to reno here. This is definitely a turn where we're renoing. I don't know what I'm doing besides that. Gotta go to clay. We gotta go to clay here. It, it's, it is mandatory that we go to clay. It's mandatory that we play clay hut builder next turn. Yeah, we gotta, we gotta play this this next turn. Um, all right, so we have to go to clay. It gives us our cooking hearth, which we need. Ba -da -ba 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 -da -ba -da Give me this, please. Thank you very much. 
thank you very much. I would like this cooking hearth. We got it. Yeah, we got the early reno. We did it. We got the early reno. Honestly, though, I was very flexible. Like, I could have taken more wood and just built with it. Like, it's not that bad to do. I, I don't mind doing it this way, too. I could have, like, done some constable things, but um, I really, really, really want... What do I want to do? I want to take another grain seeds and sow again. I really want to take grain seeds and sow again. I honestly feel like I need a little bit more food. I need to take a sow. Okay, so I need to take a sow at some point. Um, my actions this turn are going to suck. They're going to be really bad. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We can just sheep market. Whoa, we can sheep market. Whoa, this is way better because then we screw the guy with the fireplace and three veggies. Yeah, let's go, bruh. Let's go, dude. Okay, we do this first. Bam. Screw your sheep. Your sheep are mine now. Yep. All right, we're never growing, but that's okay. And we're never growing, but it doesn't matter because what we're doing is so insane that, that it just doesn't matter. You can start player. That's fine. Oh, no. Carrot Museum. No. We're getting so... So, uh... What's it called? We're getting outsweeted. <laughs> Other people are doing way sweeter things than us. We're getting outsweeted here. Um, I want to play this mantelpiece so bad, and I just can't. How can I possibly play this mantelpiece? I got to figure out some way to play this mantelpiece here. All these all these cards, I got to figure out some way to play, but I just can't. It's so lame. I don't have to play the mantelpiece. It would just be very nice. It'd be very nice to play the mantelpiece. If I don't play the mantelpiece, I could probably run out of stone, which like is probably fine anyways. Um, the real question is, what do I do? I mean, I got to just like, clay. I got a clay hut builder. I can write more. Oh, no, I can just eat another sheep. Okay. We have to play Clay Hut Builder. It's obligatory that we play that because we can build like like two more rooms with it. It's going to be totally great. Uh, yeah, it's going to be awesome. It's going to be awesome. Our plan is to build five rooms this game. Uh, we're just building to five. We're, it's going to be late because of everything, but we're going to build to five rooms. We're going to fence, and then that's when we drop our big country like a hammer. Build five rooms here. Probably plow like five fields, six fields. We fence like 11. We drop big country, bing, bang, boom. That's how we get our point ceiling up. And then that's it. That's going to be the game. All right, they know. They know. They know about about the, the lesson spot that I want it. All right, Skillful Renovator. I've been very unimpressed with Skillful Renovator. Every time I play this, it's like so much less wood than I want it to be. It's like so inconvenient. It feels good when you get the wood from it, but it just like never, it never hits right. Don't play an Ock, please. Please, no Ox. No Ock or an ease. Don't do it. Thank you for not doing it. I appreciate it. Thanks for taking the read that I will never take. Never. Not taking a Reedstone food action feels so bad, by the way. It feels so bad to, like, never, ever take a Reedstone food action. Um, I need you, Pikachu. I want to play this Wood Expert, too. This Wood Expert also is going to be completely insane if I can play it, but I don't know if I can play it. It's like so much wood because I could play this horse-drawn boat. I could play the stone cart with it. Like there's so many things I could play with this. Uh, 11. Yeah, 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 yeah. So we're, we're, we're going to, we're going to do like an eight here and then a three here. And then if I get more, then we're going to, we're going to do more. But yeah, we have, we have time. I'm a little slow on everything. It's a little slow. Like I'm going to be the last person to, to grow, do, do all that stuff. We're going to be nice and chill, but my food's going to be completely insane. So that's, that's what we get in, re in return is that we get completely nuts food here. I may take more grain. God, is it bad? I want to play. Ah, oh, wait, 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 wait. I can take, I can play this baker. Actually, we can play this baker. This baker is actually completely nuts. This baker feeds us forever. Yeah, Baker actually feeds us forever here. Baker Baker means that we never have to take a baked bread action. We, we just get to, to like sow our grain and then bake bread whenever we feel like it, which is honestly better. Like it's honestly better to have it that way. That way I'm not like reliant on a sow bake to, to not get blown out completely. Um, Am I taking a four wood here? That's a question that I want to ask myself. So four, I have to line up to build. I must line up to build on one of these turns. It doesn't have to be this turn because I'm never getting um, Family Grow. I'm never getting Family Grow here. So it's going to go Family Grow start player. Uh, ramp Clay is fine. God, I wish I had Ramp Clay. Ramp Clay with a uh, Clay Up Builder is like such a crazy combo. It's so good. Such a good combo. It's so insane. Oh, my my freaking uh, things didn't... didn't uh... Oh my God, they're messaging me now? The, the, uh, the bot people are messaging me? No, dude, they're messaging me. They're messaging me. Spam account. We've been spam. We've been messaged. 
Uh, sending malicious links. I think this is a bot account. Yes, it is a bot account. Dot. Yes, it's a bot account. Yes, I would also like to block them. I got messaged by a freaking by a uh, want to become famous bot. So lame. Pet lover. Uh, pet lover is interesting here. I'm not. I'm not big. I'm not too down on pet lover. What am I doing? Uh, all right, let's think about what we're doing. So we have enough clay to build one room. If we take a four clay, we can build two rooms. I kind of like that. I think that we're taking a four clay for sure. This guy didn't starting. What the heck? Okay, I have to build this turn then. I, I got to build this turn. It's very sad, but I have to do it. Oh, it's so sad. Do I have enough food? Okay, I have enough food to play exactly one. Um, I have to build this turn because I have to take starting player with my first action next turn. Uh, oh, but... Hmm... Hmm, wait, 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 Okay, think about this. Let's think. Think, think, think. Oh, I have two improvements. Oh, I have two ox in play. Let's go. Okay, so we can play stone cart here. We can play stone cart. Okay, okay, yeah. we can get stone cart in play. That's fine. That's something proactive that we're doing. So we're going to do this. Boom. And then we're just going to eat the sheep. Screw the sheep. We don't need the sheep. Don't care. Don't even care about the sheep. So we're taking this. This person's lining up to build again. That's fine. Uh, who can build? So no one can build right now. This person is doing whatever. That's fine. Okay, so what we're going to do is that we are going to... I'm so stupid. I can't build two rooms this turn. Why did I think I could build two rooms this turn? What was I thinking? Hmm. You know what's better than a stone cart is a horse-drawn boat? <laughs> I'm probably just going to play Baker as a two-food ock. I probably should just do that. I don't know why I thought I could do that this turn. Ah, oh, the win this game's gonna be dumb though. Um, can this guy stable block me? I think the answer is no. This person can't build right. No, no building this turn. That's good. Um, all right, no one can build on me if I if I delay building until next turn. So I can just start player, build next turn, and then get family grow and round uh, whatever. Can I do anything with this family grow? Potter ceramics. Is potter ceramics good? It gets me a million clay, or not a million clay, a million grain. It gets me approximately a million grain. Because I, I can just, like, every time, I, every harvest, I can just bake bread and turn turn things into grain. I think I have to play this baker this turn. I gotta do this, unfortunately. Because I need food, and this is a decent food action. Yeah, I want to save the sheep if possible. I also need the Aachen play for the horse-drawn boat. I could play wood expert instead. No, I can't play wood expert. I need the food too bad. All right, whatever. We'll just do it. We'll, we'll just suck it up. We'll, we'll, we'll admit that... that couple bad things happen can anyone build i gotta keep asking that question no one can build here someone can build stables but like that is fun. oh no this guy can't even build stables to freaking block me there that's insane okay whatever um we will do this we will play our baker dude we will play our plowman or not plowman baker and we will uh what hello <laughs> oh it's because it's the harvest already um i would like to bake both these grain into food that sounds good to me Oh, it's when you play it, you get a big bread action. Okay, whatever. We'll, we'll just do that anyways. We were going to do that anyways. We're going to bake two of these into food. We get another one later on. It doesn't matter. There's a million baked bread actions. I forget that Baker gives you 50 million baked bread actions. It's so insane. Uh, I am good for now. I have enough food. Yeah, I have plenty of food here. I have plenty of food. All right, so, so our plan here is to start player, play a horse run boat, and then... Probably a potter string. I'm very sad about I'm mourning this mantelpiece that I couldn't get a stone to set it up, but it makes sense, honestly. Like, it just didn't happen. It didn't have time to happen. It was my fault. It was my lack of planning that it couldn't happen, so... As it turns out, taking a read, very, very bad when you're uh, when you're playing a straw thatch roof. It's very bad to take a stone food action. It's just super not worth it. Three stone action, on the other hand. A little bit better. It's a little bit better. Uh, passing so much, so much frickin', uh, passing so much wood feels bad, but honestly, there's gonna be a lot of wood in this game. There's gonna be, a, all right, there's gonna be enough wood in this game, I'll say. There, there's not gonna be a lot of wood, but there's gonna be a lot, okay, there's the pootery. Okay, we've been, we've been swept by the blueprint. The blueprint has totally swept us here on that. Um, yep, I would like to start player, please. And I would like to draw some horses from a boat. That sounds fun to me. Do I play this Potter Ceramics? I mean, I don't really have a choice. I mean, it's basically a single grain. I mean, Potter Ceramics is essentially five food here. Potter Ceramics is essentially five food, which is fine. It's like fine. It's five food, but it's not that good. 
The real question is how quickly can we get the, uh, what is it called set up? How quickly can we get this big country set up? I don't think we're gonna be able to get it set up before like round 12, which is fine. It's not the biggest deal to not get it set up before round 12. I think we're in good shape this game. We're in, we're in good shape. We're, we did something tangent enough. We executed our plan well enough. We got to the late game well enough. We're doing totally fine. We're doing okay. Chat, how's everyone doing? Everyone doing okay? Everyone have a good week? Everybody have a good, a good old week? I'm, I'm enjoying farming on stream. It's fun. I, I, I didn't think I was going to be able to explain enough. Like, I thought it was going to be harder than it than it is. But I think it's it's okay. It's been okay so far. Got these food actions are nutter butters. I think they're they're gonna get taken this turn though. I would be shocked if they didn't get taken. Um, wait, can I can I change the card size a little bit? Hold on, I, I need to make these uh, like a little. Wait, the boards need to be smaller. Ah, there we go. That's what we needed. There we go. Look how beautifully aligned every everything is so nicely aligned now. Where where everything's very visible. Is it too small, chat? Is it is it too small? Is it fine? I don't really know what to do about everything. I could like zoom in one tick. If I zoom in one tick though, I think we have issues. Cause yeah, if I if I like shrink this down, it, it brings everything up a little bit. I can like do like this. Maybe this is better. This better. No, this is not better. Can I undo? All right, whatever. I want to undo what I just did. <laughs> I want to undo what I just did. No, I want to undo it. I, I, I take it all back. Okay, there we go. That's what we want. Sorry, I got to mess around with this. I'm going to have to mess around with this a little bit more. The well. We've been welled. Um, okay, get these settings out of here. Oh, dude, the COVID booster's rough, man. It is It is a rough bean. It, it is not a joke. I got destroyed by my COVID booster. I got, I got completely dumpstered by it. Good. I'm glad that you're getting better at music. That's awesome. That's great to hear. Getting better at music. Always pog. Always very, very pog. Yeah, I think we have to play power ceramics here. What a bummer. I couldn't play anything else, but whatever. We're just, we're just all in on, on building things. We're, we're making things happen, okay? We're, we're schmoovin'. God, I want this four, four stone so bad, though. I want it so outrageously bad. I don't think anyone else is building more rooms, which is actually insane for us because we have a stupid amount of food. I want to take a wood action with my second move here. So my moves this round are going to be, uh, I I'm going to try and get a big country up in round 11. That's that's my goal here is to extend my point cap by getting big country up in round 11. We're also definitely going for constable. This is like the most constable game of all time that we're going for. Um, it's like very, very easy. Oh, we could market stall actually. Would I rather potter ceramics or market stall? Um, I think I'd rather market stall. I think I'm gonna have plenty of food. I, I think we need a veggie. I think a veggie actually completely good for us here. We, we don't need that much grain. We don't need that much grain here this game. Like we're, we're gonna get in stupid amount of grain. Um, you don't feel like you're getting better to try something that used to be hard. Oh yeah, yeah, no, it, it's uh, sometimes it's hard. Sometimes it's hard to realize that you're getting better. It can definitely be hard to realize. Um, actually, maybe I do want to zoom it in. The stuff on the right is like really small and I want to make it not as small. So like I can do this, hold on. I'm gonna, we're gonna try really hard to make it so that this all fits. We're gonna make it all fit, maybe like this. There we go, okay, maybe that's better. That is slightly better, I think. I think that is like marginally better. I need to scoot myself over a little bit more though. Yeah, we got it. We gotta just like scooch myself over into this nice little hole here. Uh, where's the hole? Wait, where's my, my camera? There's my camera. Boom. Now I am in the hole. Put this over here. Put this over here. There we go. Okay, that's that looks good to me. That looks good to me. This is the world's latest sheep whisperer. Jeez Louise. That's a late sheep whisper chat. That's very late. Oh, this person's building again. That's a problem. Man, this person's building again. That's so lame. I don't want to have to start player again. I want to rent out a stone, but I just like can't do that. Um, yeah, we're going to get a veggie here. Getting a veggie here is actually completely insane. Definitely getting a veggie here is completely nuts. Like, if I need to, I'll play this other card to get more food. But I, I don't actually want to turn that much or, uh, clay into food. I actually only want to turn one more clay into a food here. I don't really want to turn that much into food. But, 
Yeah, everything's going good. All right, so we either want to, we want a wood action so bad here. Because our actions from like here to the end of the game are like wood, grain, and and that's it. Until until round 11, we're just taking wood and taking grain. That's that's our only actions that we're even considering. I maybe consider an Auk. What Ox do we have? Do I have Ox that are good to play? No, I mean, I'm gonna play Constable at some point, but who knows when? Who knows when we'll play? We're not, we're not, we're not playing Mantle Piece anymore. If four stone wheels, I will take that. If four stone wheels, I will take four stone because four stone is completely nuts. That allows us to reno to, to stone very easily, which further allows us to increase our point cap, which we love to see. So we're, we're going to do that if that wheels. But otherwise, if six wood wheels, it's actually very close between six wood and four stone. Given that, I know that I have Constable in my hand. Having Constable in your hand makes six wood actually look completely insane here because it cuts the wood from other people. Uh, also, okay, that person can start to make sure that they get uh, their family grow. That's fine. I think that this person's building again. That makes me very sad. There's a wood cart. Okay, wood cart, very good. Very, very good card. I think Pet Lover is so bad. I'm so low on Pet Lover. Every time I imagine playing this card, I just, I can't imagine a world where, like, it's great to play this card. Okay, I will take the four stone now. Um, are there any stone ox available? There's ovens. <laughs> Hilariously, there are ovens available. I could build a stone oven. Oh, it's so bad, though. God, the stone in this game is so trash. It's so bad. Do I even care about stone unless it hits five? I'd honestly rather have wood. Honestly, I would rather have wood than stone. It feels so bad, but the stone is not even that good. There's no stone ox that I, like, stone improvements that I want to play. I could play a stone oven here, but it's, like, it's really not that good. I would rather have the wood to accelerate my fences, honestly. It's, like, way better because of big country. I'd rather just accelerate my plan. Feels very bad to pass four stone, but I... You got to accelerate your game plan it's very very important to accelerate your game plan um okay this person's going for a sow i hope that they sow in round 10 so that way i don't have to fight for sow in round 11 that would be very nice of them um if they do so in round uh if they don't sow in round 10 i probably have to take so like stupidly early i gotta play i gotta take so like stupidly early but yeah, yeah, I need to play more piano. I, I keep uh I keep freaking like slacking on playing piano. No, are you building another room? Are you really building another room? Are you really gonna force me to start player on you? I'm so sad. I don't want to start player to grow again. Frick man. I guess I gotta start player to grow again. I gotta do it. I have no choice here. What, do I play stone cart? Um no, stone cart's not worth it. Oh, right, we're we're just naked. We're we're starting player potter ceramics and then we're gonna naked family grow here. It, it's just not worth it to freaking do anything else. Unfortunately, my dream draft of mantle piecing backfired because I, I was too pansy to take a stone and then this, this stone card ended up being pretty bad. That's unfortunate. Yeah, you're gonna build. Um, yeah, I got a start player here, unfortunately. So, okay, so what are we doing? We're gonna go start player grain. Probably gonna sow. How much grain do I need to bake? Nice thing, nice thing about this game, we literally don't have to think about food. <laughs> we, we can think about food zero and be totally fine. Pet lover seeing some use, by the way. We'd love to see it. Love to see pet lover seeing some use. Such a fun card. It's so I mean it's a fun card. I just I literally can't think of instances where I would really use pet lover. Okay, this person's trying to posture Reno. That's fine. Or actually they just have pottery, BMW joinery. Which honestly is gonna inflate their score. It's gonna make it look a lot higher. Um yes, I would like to bake bread. I will bake the bare minimum of bread that I need to bake here because I would like to sow as much grain as possible. So, all right, we'll bake one. One's the bare minimum. I have a bunch of food incoming from this horse-drawn boat because horse-drawn boat's nutty. Uh, am I taking five stone? Uh, am I taking five stone, dude? Is anyone else building again? Why would I fight in on family growth where I could just take wooden fence? Why would I do that? If I get a big wood stack that goes around to me, I'm taking that instead. If I get a six wood that, like, if, if it goes freaking, like, no, it's there's no chance it gets to me. There's no chance it gets to me. But if it does, I'm taking six wood. If it doesn't get to me, I probably have to starting player. All right, cook the sheep. Yep, we got, we got more food. Poggies. Poggies for more food. Love to see it. Uh, I want that six wood. I'm not getting it, but I want it. If I don't get it, 
I might take the five stone. Five stone is ab actually just like a, a two and a half point action straight up. It's so good. I can rent out big country if I really need to. Um, If I get six wood, is there any way I can get big country? Big country might just be dead, actually. I don't have enough actions to get it up. It might just be dead. It might just be constable time. If I play constable, how much wood is this worth? Wait, how much wood is constable worth, chat? Hold on, I need, I need to check this. I right, muckrake, that's fine. How much wood is this worth? Uh, This is worth uh two wood. Okay, that's not very good. It's not worth very much wood, unfortunately. Oh my god! Starting player to build? Let's go! Uh, I don't care about the stone as much as I care about the wood. The wood is, like, so completely insane here. Can I get this? Hold on. Okay, I have to count actions now. Okay, so wood. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, okay, chat. Okay, what? wood. Wood fence grain. Grain. Build. Starting player. I can do big country, but at what cost? I don't get to sow. Not getting to sow is not the biggest deal. It's not the biggest deal. We're for sure taking the wood. It's like not even close that we take the wood here because A, fencing is nuts, but also B, um, I, it's just fencing is nuts. Uh, <laughs> So, for all those reasons, we're taking the wood here. All right, that's fine. We don't care about the stone at all. I really, like, renoing to stone would be nice, but I'm not banking on it. That's not the main way I'm getting my points here. Really, I would love to set Big Country if we could. The problem with saying a Big Country is I'm leaving, like, so many animal pairs on the board for people. Um, which, to be fair, some of those animal pairs probably get to me. I probably get some of those. Also, I probably don't get to Family Grow until a little bit later. Man. Fence? I think I should go for it. At the very least, like, it lets me set it up for round, like, 12 or whatever. Like, it's not that bad. Okay, this person's gonna... God, there's gonna be so many animal pairs. No, dude, not like this. There's gonna be such a stupid amount of animal pairs here. Like, such an insane number of animal pairs. Uh, I, I should take an animal pair. I should fence here. Fence 11. Fencing 11 is still very, very good, but I should just take animal pairs. Like, I should just be taking the pigs. I should be taking the two cows when they come to me because inevitably I'm going to get them. Like, I should just be doing that. That's way better. And then we can, like, we can get this later on. Like, I can sew if I need to. I can take my time with everything. Like, I want to get a sew down this, this round, this stage. So, yeah, let's just take our time. Let, let's take our time with things. We can sow. We get a million grain. Uh, we are definitely going to fence here, though. It's a little bit annoying because it means we have to fence again later so that we can get a sh our sheep capacity up. But I don't really mind it that much. We're going to do this. Boom. The starting player to build is a mistake, by the way. It's a mistake to, to like, eat up all the wood out of the game and then build a fourth room. This is, a this is like, a classic blunder of, of, like, you think you have enough resources to do something, but you actually don't. Like, the reason that I can build five rooms is because I'm building it all in clay, and I have a stupid amount of clay in this game. Like, that's the reason I can build five rooms here. Like, for a lot of these people, building the fourth room was a mistake. Like, they should have just focused on animals. But now, because I, like, got the resources to pivot, now I can just pick up two animal pairs, and then that's going to, like, end the game pretty fast. Um, I may... What I might do here... I want the animal pair. What am I doing? Okay, so we're going animal pair, animal pair, grain cell. Animal pair, animal pair, grain cell. That's what we're doing here. Yeah, that, that's what we're doing. Animal pair, animal pair, grain cell. That's what we are on about. Because, And then I'm going to eat the sheep. We're going to eat the sheep afterwards because we, we are going to get a sheep on the uh, last harvest of the game. So we don't need to care about sheep that much. We just get a sheep the last harvest of the game and then everything's fine. <laughs> yeah, they made the classic blunders. Uh, oh, cattle feeder? Uh, I strongly suspect that that is bad for me they didn't sow this turn no dude they didn't sow this turn why though why would you not sow this turn what are you doing bro if he blocks my grain i have to block his sow wait is he even sowing i don't even know if this person's sowing shoot dude shoot dude i want the cows so bad 
right, this clay embankment does nothing. <laughs> it does nothing. I do not need any more clay than I already have. I need zero more clay. Uh, does this person have food? They have food. Yeah, they have carrot museum with a bunch of food. No way they take cattle feeder, right? There's no way. There's no way they take it. There's no, there is no chance they take the grain on me. They might sow on me. That would be mildly annoying. There's no chance they take this grain on me. No shot. Yeah, whatever. I don't care. Don't, don't even think about it. Don't you even think about it. Don't be a piece. Don't do it. Take the forward. Look, you need this forward. Look at this juicy forward. It allows you defense a bunch. Like, it's super good. Super nice and juicy. You don't need this grain, bro. You are such a piece. No. No, dude. We've been bamboozled. No, now we have to sew. No, dude. Not like this. Now we got to sew. I might actually have to plow a field here. Womp womp. So dumpstered. I don't even think this person needed food. You have six veggies, bro. What are you doing with six veggies? That's 50 million veggies and seven stone. That's so many veggies in stone. Imagine if we had that many veggies in stone, what we could do. Whatever, it's fine. It's fine. Yeah, you can take that. You take your animal pair. I mean, what are we doing besides sewing here? We're building a room, I guess. I guess we're just building a room. So build a room. Yeah, it sounds fine to me. We'll just so build a room. All right, we're sewing. You got me. I got to sew here. It's very sad. Got to sew because this veggie doubles here and it, it gives us a bunch of grain to feed with. So I got to do it. Um, I'll just bake the one one clay into to bread right now or the one grain into be bread. We'll just do that now because I need one one bread. I would like one bread to feed, please. Um, so yeah, we'll just do that now. Why not? All right, this baker is like a nice security blanket, but it's not really pulling its weight. I, I kind of regret the baker a little bit. Yeah, this is for a family grow. I'm a little sad about this. I might plow a field here. If plow a field gets to me, I'm gonna very seriously consider plowing a field here. I'm gonna very, very seriously consider that because I really would like to play um, this big. Oh no, no, I can, I can uh, farm expansion here. Uh... Yeah, this is this is all annoying. Everything that happened just now is very annoying. Okay, well, plow doesn't get to us. We're just gonna build a room. We're we're just building a room here. Everything that happened, I'm very annoyed by, but it doesn't really matter because we're so far ahead. We're like stupidly far ahead here. Getting these two animal pairs is, is just like so insane. Getting these two animal pairs is like so ridiculous. But yeah, like now this person's gonna struggle to build any fences. Like, are they going for a fifth room? Is this the legendary? No, they have just BMW stuff. Okay, they have BMW stuff going on. Uh, I would be upset if they went for a fifth room here. I would be not happy about it because it only screws me. It doesn't screw anyone else. We're just gonna build a room here. We just build a room. It's fine. I pass. Um, oh, I'm going to cook my sheep now, actually, because we don't care about our sheep. Goodbye, sheep. You've been a nice house sheep for so long. I have to let you go. I got to let you go. Sorry, sheep. Sorry, buddy. We got to let you go. It, it's been a good ride, but it's time to let you go. We're, we're on the, the cow the cow and uh, boar train right now. I do need to fence again. Oh, my God. Whoops. I scrolled so far. Down. I forgot my scroll wheel is like very sensitive at this. Sorry about that. Um, this card's hot. I love this card. I wish that I had taken this in retro. Oh, I took Clay Hub Builder instead. Actually, I don't. I don't regret. No regrets. But um, so I'm glad. I'm kind of glad that I, I took uh, Clay Hub Builder instead of this. But I wanted this card very bad. But it's gonna work out. It's gonna be fine. Probably this big country is going to be a single. Uh, it's gonna be one point and two food, which is not great. I, I would love to go plow plow start player here. That would be ideal for me. Or plow plow family grow, but that's not happening. Um, so that's the goal is to plow plow do that. Okay, we don't care about this. Yeah, I would like to confirm this. Stardew Valley music, so good, by the way. It's so good. Like, outrageously good. One of my favorite music genres, Stardew Valley <laughs> music. God, the grain take was so mean, dude. What a mean grain take. I guess this person doesn't really need much stone. They just all want all their veggies to chill. Is anyone competing with me right now? I don't know. Sometimes I'll get like, so I'll have a plan that goes so deep that I just like, I, I won't have time to care about how anyone else is doing until the end. Like that, that tends to be a theme of my game sometimes. 
I would like to pay six to feed my family. That seems reasonable. Seems reasonable to pay pay a little bit of stuff to feed my family. Um, okay, I want the I want to have three boars by the end of the game. I definitely need to take a little bit more wooden fence again, or I need to take stables. I need to do one of those things. I need to either build stables, and given I need to build stables, maybe I was supposed to delay building the room, but I don't know. It's not like super important. I see. Make sure this constable comes down, like at like later on. I need to make sure this constable's good. That's that's what we really need in life. We need to make sure the constable's good, which it will be, because there's no there's no chance that either of these two people get to fill in their farm. No chance. Th this guy might be able to actually. This guy might be able to because he can go plow plow here and then. Um, oh, can you not see my mouse? Oh yeah, you can see my mouse, right? You can see my mouse. No, you can't see my mouse. That's funny. I hid my mouse. Does it bother you that you can't see my mouse? All right, whatever. Purple purple can plow two spaces along the top of their farm, and then they can uh, s they can fence on the left side of their farm if they really want to, to get constable points. If they want to, they can do that. So I'm doing plow grain? No family growing for me. Womp womp. Plow grain star player. Is that what I'm doing? Plow Green Start Player? All right. Yeah, Plow Green Start Player. Uh, also has the benefit of cutting the plows, which is nice. Yeah, because I, I really am good on food. I'm really good on food here. We'll just plow. We'll just plow. This person doesn't have a grain, and that would make me extremely upset if they, if they took a grain on me. I would be very upset by that. But they should know that they can get a grain later in the game. They should know that. I'd be very upset. I want this big country to work. I need this big country to, to feel good about myself. <laughs> I need this big country. Actually, uh, mainly I need big country because I want a family grow without room and a family grow next turn if that happens. But someone will probably take starting. Like someone's probably going to take starting and I'm probably going to get a little bit sad because of that. But that's fine. That's fine. All right, you take your, your cow or your things. How did this person get three grain? Oh, because they took one from this, one from this. How'd they get? Oh, they have granary too. Okay, they took granary. I see. I missed the granary there. Reno. Yep, Reno something I do not have to care about because I don't think we're going to get to Reno this game. We might get to Reno, actually. Renoing might happen this game. Oh, I could have... One thing I could have considered is fencing two to fence that in. I don't think that's worth it, though. I think I'd rather have the fifth field. The fifth field's so good here. I want to sow more grain because that's our primary way of feeding. But yeah, this baker wasn't, like, amazing. God, Eastern and Western Quarry can only stack... Yeah, see, like, th this is why I didn't want to get stone here is because this is going to happen. Like, st uh, rendering to stone here has never been worse. It has never been worse to run out of stone. There's nothing I'm doing with this reno at all literally nothing i could fence with the reno if i fence with the reno it's not bad but it's like it's like three actions for five points which is just awful like it's not awful but it's very bad i can do way better than that what are you doing you want to bake your bread did you want to bake bread because if you want to bake bread you gotta uh bake the bread hehe <laughs> I added some incentives. I didn't know who was going to come and chill out and chat, but um, I, I added some, like, explain Agricola and then explain Agricola badly for, for people that uh, are interested. And in, if you're watching this and you've never seen Agricola before, which is likely because a lot of my followers have never seen Agricola before, cause they're probably like, okay, what is this? We're, we're putting these weird fields in our farm. We got these freaking, you know, if I, if I look at my farm here, then, uh, you know, we've got, we've got these weird people that are being placed on this board right they're taking actions what's going on why is this cow all alone on the cattle market space i don't actually know you know how did this person urgently wish for children what's the difference between that and just regularly wishing for children right like it's you know oh i need to that is not what i meant to do Hold on we gotta zoom out again you gotta zoom out again i gotta fix all my stuff okay we're, we're fixing it okay there we go uh all right what was i doing again oh yeah we're, we're graining grain love you grain Green's my favorite green. Boom. And then we start player. Yo, what's up? Uh, what, Nugget Bridge? Oh, Nugget Bridge. Uh, thank you for the have fun. Oh, explain the game badly. Um, oh, sorry, I didn't even see that. I was too busy zooming in. Um, so uh, have you ever wanted to get your hoe 
and take three of your friends that they all get their hose and then you compare your hose to each other in order to see whose hoe is better. Well, that's what Agricola is, except for you also get to compare your pets, the swankness of your house, and additionally, how many people you've procreated as well. You compare all those things, you, you, you battle hoes, you battle animals, you battle your, your houses, you, you, you see whose crib is better, and then that's, that is Agricola. So that's that's uh that's that's a Gricklin in a nutshell, I think. I, I think that 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 about covers it. Chat type um type uh type type kappa if you agree. I, I think that's about it. Um all right, what are we doing? Oh we did it, chat! Let's go! We did it! Give it to me. Give me my points. Give me my points. Let's go. We did it. We lift the the round the round uh, freaking twelve big country dream. All right, good. Good. I'm glad I got it. I'm glad we got it. Glad that we got it. Love to see it. I I honestly feel like we nailed it. Feel like we nailed it. All right. So now we get to do fun things. Yeah, we're, it's never, we're never renewing to stone. There, there's no way we're renewing to stone, right? I mean, maybe we are, but I don't think that we are. Okay, so we go family, family growth, this. We're probably playing the stupid Potter ceramics for, cause it's worth a freaking, it's worth three food. This Potter ceramics is worth three food. Um, urgently wishing for, oh, okay. So, so when you want a child really bad, um, basically what you have to do is that you have to, you know, you, you just hope for a child, but you do so like really, really urgently. And, and by urgent, I mean like you got to go to at least five different churches and talk to at least five people in the confessional booth and say, yo, I really want this child. Bonus points if it's from different religions, right? You hit up one, you know, hit up one Protestant, one Catholic, just go around and try and figure out, you know, okay, how, how can I... How can I, how can I, you know, get as many chances as possible at this? If you complete all those steps, then boom, your urgent wish is granted. And that's it. Don't even try to understand it. Not a Friday evening. Yeah, if you, if you want to flavor on everything, uh, let me know. So like, like right now, we're, we got a field watchman who's watching over the fields. Um, and so he, he's giving us lots of fields because he's watching over them. Um, and then because he's watching over the fields, we also are a baker, so we get to bake the grain, which essentially means that we get to turn the grain into food. Uh, and we have this nice big cooking hearth because we're a very rich family. We can afford nice big cooking hearth in order to bake our grain into nice juicy food. And because we have so much grain, we can build this throth thatched roof, which means that we know we can just build our roofs in grain. We don't even need reed to, to build our home anymore, which is great. Um, all right, so we're family growing here. What's the other action that I'm taking? Uh, probably would because we need another fence. Probably would because we need a fence here. Uh, I could play constable for a wood. That seems bad. We need wood here so we can fence. Wood for fences. What am I doing next turn? Next turn I'm going so... I don't need an animal. Yeah. Not getting a fence action this turn's kind of rough. One, two... Yeah, this isn't this isn't gonna be too bad. Okay, we're we're taking the wood here. There, there's nothing else that I would even consider other than wood here. I don't think just like process of elimination. There's there's no other action that's even remotely close to wood because we need we need defense again, and the, and this gives us enough fences. Don't you do that, dude? Um. Okay. Question: Am I fencing this turn? No, we can't fence this turn. Okay, that's fine. We can take a stable instead. A stable accomplishes something very similar. Uh, we can also take two stone actions and try and reno here. I think reno is going to be a bad idea, though. It looks like we have one, two, maybe three renos in the reno queue. Reno looks kind of scuffed, too. Um, not a Friday evening. It's okay. It's okay. Just just watch the meeples go to the board, and uh, and everything will be okay. That, that's the, the line. 36. Where are we scoring this game? It's probably like a 50, right? This is like a 50 ball. Okay, this person's also going to get constable points, but I don't really care because I just want to maximize my score. Oh, unless they don't get greener veggie, though. I need a sow next turn. I have to take a sow next turn. It's very obligatory. I, I don't want to take sow this turn, though. This person's sowing on me. No, no person's sowing on me next turn. We'll just family grow this turn. 50-50. Yeah, yeah, it's 50-50. It's all 50-50. Uh, I will just family grow. There's no reason not family grow. We'll, we'll family grow and take our three-point action. 
I definitely messed this draft. I definitely played this draft like pretty mopily. Um, I'm, I want to fence with my first action here. I would love to fence. Fencing is a two point action for me. If I don't get a fence, I'm probably just going to aim for stables and that would be good. But yeah, we want a 50. We definitely want a 50. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I think so. So every family member is worth three points. Uh, so family members are very good. We're gonna get, we got five family members now. So we we I get we got a big family. So that's why I said right. We got we got to have like, you know, we're comparing the size of not only our crib but also our our family as well. They're both very important. So also the the size of like where your where your animals live that's also important. You got you got to have a very nice habitat for your animals. Very very nice habitat for your animals. So yeah, this this number below this number of stars below my name is how well I'm doing. So more stars equals better. Um, all right, so if we play constable, purple is also getting constable. No one else is getting constable. I do not think so. Constable seems fine. It seems fine here. Is there any other card that I could play here? No, not really. I, I feel like I, I punted by by not trying to play this mantelpiece, but like taking an action earlier felt really bad. But whatever, it's fine. Darn you, straw thatch roof for being too good. Imagine passing big country and then getting it wheeled to you, anyways. <laughs> Probably if I had just played big country on like turn six or whatever, everything could have been like totally fine. I probably could have done that and gotten the exact same score, but that's super lame. Actually, maybe not. I'm probably getting a higher score playing it this way than I would if I had just big country immediately. I'm probably getting a little bit of a higher score. The goal of this game, so yeah, so this game is a, uh, it is a, a Euro game, which means that the score is determined by the amount of victory points that you have. So essentially every single thing that you do scores you victory points. So like for scoring fields, so this is like how the scoring works um, in the upper part is victory points. Every category is worth victory points. So basically fields, if you get five fields is worth four victory points. If you get a bunch of uh, pastures worth victory points, grain and veggies worth victory points, uh, animals worth victory points. So everything is worth victory points um additionally your rooms the, the higher quality they are they're worth more victory points having family members are worth victory points and your cards can be worth victory points so you'll notice that like on um this card that i have here it has this nice gold symbol on it that means it's worth victory points um so yeah so everything is worth victory points you're trying to get the highest amount of victory points possible one thing that's worth noticing about this is that um if you have zero of a category so on the left here it, it says zero of a category you get minus one victory points so you uh yeah so it's it's a lot of math it's a lot of math so basically it's it's get the highest amount of math possible you get the highest score possible and that's it that that's the no mason mason no wait can this guy even reno Oh, yeah, stone cutter. Okay, stone cutter. Okay, so we're going. Okay, so so it's going. Uh, Reno fence. Reno. Wait, Reno fence. Uh, I get a so right. Yeah, I got a so on the wheel. So we got a fence with our first action. We must fence with our first action. Uh, I don't need to bake bread here. No, I don't. We'll bake bread next turn because why not? I should eat an animal though. Wait, can I eat an animal? Wait, I want to eat animals. Can I eat some animals, please? I need to eat animals. My animals need to get eaten. I need to eat animals. I actually have an insane amount of food. Why is my food so insane in this game? Darn you, Cooking Arthur, giving me too much food. Whatever. We're just we're just easily winning this game. I don't I don't think. No, Sheepwalker gives stuff, dude. No, I'm I'm hopefully hopefully Plow So gets taken. I'm hoping because I don't want to take So with my first action. I really like defense. I, I don't need so here. It's a two point action for me, but like I'm very point capped here, and I can't get a Reno in, so we're just we're just like stupidly point capped. What can I do to increase my point cap here? Not much. Um, okay, so we're gonna cook a boar, and we're not cooking a cow. Yeah, we're gonna cook a boar, not cook a cow. That's how we're gonna feed. We're gonna we're gonna like save cows here. Actually, this is stupid. This is stupid. Everything's stupid. Um, that's fine. Whatever. We'll just feed our family. It's fine. We just feed our family this way. That's fine. Uh, yep. Confirm it. That's okay. Don't care. We'll, we'll deal with it later. We'll deal with it later. It's going to be fine. Um, alrighty. Get all these boars out of here. Um, put all the cows in this pasture. Put all the boars in this pasture. And then put the boar in the house. So now we have a house boar. And then we're good. Okay. So we have a house boar. We have our, our uh, big pasture of cows that's good and then we're gonna fence there yeah i think we have to fence i think fencing is worth too many points i think it's actually like a three-point action okay we need this very desperately so we are gonna put the sheep sheep you're back we brought the sheep back to the house the sheep is back in the house ladies and gentlemen we did it okay we have too much food and i hate it man we didn't even get to use this pyro ceramics 
All right, well, we have a stupid amount of food here. That's cool. A completely insane amount of food. Uh, Wait, do I need defense? Wait, 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 wait. Oh, we do need defense. Yeah, we do need defense. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. We have defense. Got defense. It's going to go reno. Uh, wait, is it going to go reno fence? No, dude. I got a fence. But I might not get a fence. I have to fence, but I get, might not get a fence. I mean, I get a fence. Yeah, so that's reno fence. This person has to decide between renoing. Oh, no, no, they're going to. Okay, I'm just dumb. No, no, they have to reno. They have to reno here. Oh, my God, dude. They have to reno. Oh, because it, fencing is not even that good for them because they have uh, joinery. It's not even that good defense because they have joinery here. So they have to reno. Otherwise, they don't get this fifth room on Mason. So they must reno here. Must do it. Um, I think this means I guess so action. Please take Plasso. Please, Purple, take Plasso. I would love you so much if you took Plasso here. Please take Plasso. Please, please, please. I, it, Purple's for sure going to take Plasso because they have a bunch of veggies. They, they, they got to take Plasso here. Please, please. Plasso. Plowing and sowing. Both plow and sow. Just keep keep my grain utilization. Just keep keep off of it, please. Just no, no utilizing grain. Just don't do it. Don't do it. I would I would very greatly appreciate it if you could not utilize this grain. That would be super duper nice. This is the part of the game where you have to pray a little bit that everything works out in your favor. <laughs> There's a lot of praying in this part of the game, it feels like. Yeah, what are we doing here? We're doing fencing. We're doing, I don't, outside of fencing and sewing, I am like so stupidly point capped. I will take the sheep if I get a chance to. I sincerely doubt we're gonna get a chance to though. I, I don't think it's gonna happen. I don't think it's gonna happen, unfortunately. What are, where are the improvements that I can play? Oh, we're playing Constable as well, because Constable's worth a bunch of points. Yes! I love you, you took Plasso. My hero, my hero for taking Plasso here, actually. I'm so stupidly point capped here. I may not hit a 50, actually. I may not hit a 50. I might, I might be like a high 40s, which would be a little bit disappointing for me, I think. Um, I, I definitely would be a little disappointed with that. It's my fault, though, for, for just not taking the stone. I'm probably just supposed to take the stone and just be be not stubborn about uh, taking a reno or taking taking the stupid thing, because I, I never end up renoing. It would have been like five points earlier on to do the thing, so... Okay, that's even more interesting that we're taking a uh, Urgent Wish for Children here. I think that's very, very interesting. Yeah, this is Reno. I get defense. Because at worst, it costs me a point because I can just take a veggie here instead. Because I, I do not need food. My food is so set here. Yeah, this baker was a mistake. <laughs> field fences! Whoa! Field fences. Field fence is so good. Field fences just gives you the free fence action. It doesn't give you a reduction on fences because he has no fields, but that's still pretty juicy. I might get the sheep back, actually. I may get the sheep back here. Getting the sheep back here would be pretty nice, honestly. That would be pretty juicy. That'd be very juicy. If, if we miss so, but we get the sheep back, I will be very happy about that. If we miss so, but get the sheep back, I'm, I'm totally happy with that. Yeah, we got a big, a big old pasture there. Humongous pasture. I think I'm still winning, but I think it's actually kind of close. I think I'm still winning, but it's like kind of, kind of, kind of close. Um, yeah, I'll fence. We'll, we'll fence some more. Fence this, confirm. I would like to put these, hold on, can I reorganize my animals, please? Yeah, let, let's let's reorganize things. Let's put all the cows in here. And then we're gonna, we're gonna put the sheep back in here. Okay, cool, now I'm happy. Just, I just need defense for the animal space because you can only hold one type of animal in a pasture. So we gotta we gotta make sure that we keep that space nice and nice and open. No, dude, my soul. My soul, whatever, at least we get the, the sheep, right? Please, please take not the sheep. I would like to get the sheep here. We, I would really, really like the sheep. <laughs> I would, I would really like this sheep. This sheep would be really nice. Actually, is it even that nice? It's not that nice. The sheep is literally the same as the pigs here. The sheep and the pigs are both exactly the same. Same as the cows. The cows are also the same amount of points. I'm just taking animals for a point here. That's so sad. That is so sad. Alexa played Despacito. That is so sad. Uh, wow, these food piles got insane. I just realized. <laughs> I just realized there's eight food piles sitting here. That's so insane. These are eight. That's nuts. That is absolutely nuts. Hmm. 
Hmm. Yeah, I guess we're going to hit a 50, but it's going to be closer than I want it to be. It's going to be a little closer than I want it to be. Just a little bit closer. But not too close. Hopefully we can keep the games rolling tonight, by the way. Because normally I stream for like six hours. So normally I'm like a six hour Andy or something like that. So hopefully we can just keep all the games rolling. That's that's my goal. Keep the games rolling. Because I, li I like keeping games rolling. It's very fun. Yep. You got your food. Very cool. It is a lot of food. That is a ton of food. I've, I've been I've had so much food this game. Okay, what am I doing? Oh, we got a sew back. Oh my gosh, we got a sew back. Yeah, we're, we're slamming this sew. Somehow we got a sew back, and I'm not really sure how, but that's okay. Okay, this is our food for the entirety of the game, and that too. Very cool. Very poggers. Uh, sure, I'll pay. Actually, this is bad. I should keep this for food tie breaks. Um, do I care? Wait, pass. Wait, 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 wait. Restart turn. Restart turn. I take it back. I take it back. I take it all back. I want my food tie break, okay? It's very, very important that I, I keep my food tie break. It, or not my food tie break. My resource tie break. It's very important. Three, four, five, ten. Yeah, whatever. Uh, pass. I'll bake one of these because why not? It doesn't matter. There's no, there's no like grain lover or anything like that in this game. There's, there's no way to turn grain into, into points that, that other people can have. My sheep. What does this have on it? Does it have sheep on it? I can't even tell. I got, I got to look. Oh yeah, it has some sheep on it. Okay, cool. So it's got some sheep on it. Um, so this person's missing cows. There's the cows. I want an animal pair of some kind. It's worth a point to me to get an animal pair, so that'd be nice. I want animal pair, lessons, and then question mark. Please, please don't do it. Please don't do it. Please take your... Wait, what is this person doing, actually? Uh, not an animal pair. Let's go. Uh, I probably should take lessons here, but I actually don't care about lessons because it gives purple... Oh, that's a spicy one. Um, it's not very good, unfortunately, because this person's farm kind of... They went... One problem with these blueprint strategies, by the way, if you go too all in on it and you end up with a farm like this where you have every single major improvement but no farm, you're going to have bad score. It's just how it works. I've done it many times. I've been there, done that. It sucks really bad. It, it's it's a bad feeling, but like you gotta you gotta not do this. You gotta build up your farm first and get a good farm before you do this because it is not as good as you think it's going to be. Um, I will take an animal pair because that is one of my only avenues to points here. So we'll do that. Uh, sure, why not? My sheep can live inside a nice little pasture by itself. Just have a bragger. Yeah, fortunately, ban list is on. I'm pretty sure. Fortunately, if, if Banlist were off here, then I'm in trouble. <laughs> Banlist is off, we're in trouble. Banlist is off, I'm in I'm in big trouble. It's a big monk S here. What am I even hitting? We're hitting exactly a 50. We're hitting exactly a 50 here. What a bummer. I am not happy with a 50 of this game. I'm not happy with it. Even though it's going to be a winning game, like it's going to be pretty easily winning, I'm not happy with it. This game went okay. It went okay. You have no idea. Yo, what's up, Hideous Science? Uh, so, okay, so so to explain it, we're playing Agricola. Basically, all these things on our farm, uh, they give us points. So every, everything is worth points, right? So these animals that I have, the, these like... Hold on, let me zoom in. Let me zoom in. Okay, so we're zooming in so that way you can see my farm really quick. All right, so this here is my farm right here. All right, so this is my farm. This is my farm. All right, so so basically on my farm, we got people that live in this farm right on the left. They live in the farm. People are worth points. Every person is worth three points. Uh, fields, fields are worth points, right? We sow these these crops in our in our on our farm. That's worth points. Okay, that's a card that someone's playing. That's fine. We play these cards throughout the game. These cards like individualize our, our experience. So like this card, for example, says whenever we take this grain action space, then we plow a field. So that's good. So basically, the way that this game works is a worker placement game. So all these workers we play onto a communal board, which is here. So all these workers go on this board. Once one action space gets taken, then no one else can use it. So like for this grain seeds, once I took, once someone takes this grain seed action, which gives you a grain, no one else can. Take this so um it is a game built around this resource placement so we're, we're fighting for these actions and we're trying to make our farm as good as possible and get the most points as possible so basically we're just trying to get as many points as possible so zooming back out right now uh we want how much percent oh actually this looks kind of nice though but i want i want everything to be on one screen i'm a sucker for everything being on one screen here so uh yeah so like 
um, for, you know, zooming out, right? So everyone's farm looks like this. This is what everyone's farm looks like. Um, and everyone has these cards in front of them that, like, change their, their placing. But so you can see all the scores on the right here. The more stars means more points. So right now I'm winning. Right now I have 46 points, so I'm winning. So, yeah, it's a complex game. It's a very complex game. It's very, like, not beginner friendly. So I, I had a feeling, like, when I streamed, like, okay, maybe. I, I, I've just been playing this game a lot. So I was like, okay, I just want to play a, a you know, nice little Agricola stream. Have a nice little time. But, um, yeah, how are you doing, Idiot Science? How's it going? Thanks for stopping by, even though you have no idea what's going on here. I, I appreciate it. <laughs> I might play a little Super Auto Pets later. I might I might do some Super Auto Pets, because Super Auto Pets, very fun game. Very, very fun. So I might, I might do a little Super Auto Pets later. We'll see. I, I, I'm going to keep games of this rolling, though. Um, they're typing GGs in, by the way, a little bit early. I like to wait on the GGs until, uh, until like, at, like in the feeding phase of the harvest is when I like to throw out the GGs. That's when I like to throw out the GG. So I'll wait. I'll wait until the the harvest, and then we'll throw out GGs. We'll wait for that. I I think it's a little it's a little premature to throw out GGs because we don't really know how the scores are going to resolve yet. I don't really know. I'm about to make someone's. Oh, I'm about to give everyone points. Actually, all these people are going to get points except for it's poor Intel here. Intel's going to get kind of rolled by this. Sorry, buddy. Um, is there any way that I can get points here? How else can I get points? No, I can't. I can't get points. Oh, Ock got taken. No. Ock got taken. I'm so sad. Um, oh, we could build a stable. Let's go. Pog. <laughs> All right, screw it. Whatever. It would have given three people points anyways. It would have been it would have been a bunch of points for other people, so it's fine. We'll just build our stable and be happy about it. We'll, we'll take our stable and be fine with it. That's okay. Here, have a nice, have a nice little stable. Draft games. I mean, it's basically a draft game. Super Auto Pets is so good. It's so good. It's so so good. It's like easy to follow. It's it's easy to 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 vibe with. Yeah, I'm not very happy with the score. Getting a 47 is okay. I guess it was like theoretically a 50 if I had just like not been dumb and and just like played the thing. But whatever, it's fine. Confirm. But yeah, it's a uh, it's a good good time. Half timbered house, yeah. Half timbered house would have been good. Um, someone someone in the chat saying half timbered house. They thought it was going to be half timbered house. Very good, but uh, it's it's uh, it basically gives you a point for every stone house you have. So like it would have given Intel six points, which is a lot of points. It's a lot of points for for a stone house. That's a lot of points. Yeah, I just um. My game plan went pretty well, honestly. Like, there were a couple of flubs in it. Like, freaking, this baker sucked. This baker was not good. This baker was absolutely not good. But I don't know what I would have played instead. Like, I could have played the wood expert instead. Like, it probably would have been better. Gotten me a little bit more wood earlier. Like, that probably would have been a little better. Obviously, I'm sad I missed out on the constable, but that's neither here nor there. Yeah, I don't know. I, I there's probably some some things that went wrong. It's pro it was not the best game. My minor draft kind of ended up sucking. I, I regret the stone cart very heavily. I don't remember why I picked the stone cart over, but I regret it very heavily. I don't regret the uh, the the freaking other thing though. That that I, but honestly, like if I had just played, if I had just played this mantelpiece, everything would be poggy woggies. If I had just played this, I, I would have like a, a over fifty right now. But I just was stubborn and decided to not play it. I just was, at all points, I was just stubborn. Like, I could easily have an over 50 if I just played the mantelpiece, but I decide not to, because I'm stubborn like that. That's okay. Whatever. Field Watchman's still broken. Still a very good card. Very, very, very good card. So, yeah, I think we're going to win. Pretty sure we're going to win. We're playing with this beta deck of cards, so I'm not going to have, like, a rating change or anything, but, yeah, I'm going to have a 48 here. It's going to be my final score. I don't think anyone is beating that. Pretty sure no one is beating that. It's closer than I want it to be, though. Like, for this ELO, I should be beating them by, like, 10, I think. I, th I think I should be beating these people by 10, like, pretty pretty uh, handily, and I'm not quite doing that, which is a bummer. That's okay. We'll just we'll just continue, continue on with our day. All right, these people are feeding very slow, by the way. I need to go to the bathroom, but I'm waiting until this game's over because I don't, don't want to like be the guy delaying the finish of the game. I really don't want to do that. Do not want to delay the finish of the game by being that guy. Don't want to do that. Manage moderation settings. Okay. I don't know why I got a little pop up. No, dude. Why? Oh, okay. They're feeding. Okay. They're feeding. It's fine. It's fine. It's fine. They're feeding. They're doing their thing. They're feeding their, their animals. Seven. Seven cows. That's a lot of cows, bro. 
that's so many cows. Um, yeah, whatever, this is fine. We'll, we'll keep our fifth cow in here. We'll, we'll keep our fifth cow in our house. We, we'll have a nice little house cow at the end of the game. That's fine. All right, GG. Uh, 48, 43, 41, 40. Very, very clean game from us. Like, 48's fine. I mean, it's a fine score. It's not, like, great. It's not terrible. I'll take it.